Good morning, everyone. My name is Kim Carlisle. And I'm Sarah Carlisle. And we have a shop full of Heise glassware. We're located just north of Indianapolis, Indiana. And our shop is open at this time by appointment only. So please get a pencil and paper ready. We're going to show you our email address in a minute. This morning's video is another edition of Half Price Thursday. Half Price Thursday, where we pull items out of the shop for storage. And we put them on a table outside this room, and everything will be sold for one half the price that's marked on it. So if you're ready, we're going to show you our email address. Again, my name is Kim Carlisle. And I'm Sarah Carlisle. And the email address is the letter K C A R L I S L at A T T dot N E T. And there is no E on the end of Carlisle on that email address. I'm going to give you a quick little preview of our shop. We have 18 cases and 9 tables, chock full of Heise glassware. We do buy Heise, one piece or an entire collection. So if you know someone that has any Heise for sale, please have them get in contact with us and maybe we can buy it. For this morning's video, we can combine several weeks of videos so we're not sending you maybe a box with just a salt cellar in it. We can put several pieces in that box before you ship it. we ship it to you. So if you're ready, Sarah and I are going to back out of this room and we're going to give you a preview of what is on the table this morning. Good morning, everyone, and welcome to another edition of Half Price Thursday. I'm going to give you a quick little preview of what's available this morning. If you see anything you're interested in, you know the routine. You can call, text, or email. If you don't have our phone number, you have to do is send us an email. We will send you a response with our phone number in it, and then you can start texting us. I'm going to plug those three shows at the end of it, and you have to wait until the very end to see another item that we're going to be taking to the show in June. It's going to be a great piece this morning, so stick around for it. So well, let's get started right back down in the corner. What have we got, Sarah? We have an opal beaded swag tankard with a nice floral cut or decoration on it. And it's $125. Good condition. Good handle. Next piece we have, we have a Puritan Comport. We have two of them. We have a little jelly, and then we have a larger size. What's the prices on them, Sarah? 20 for the larger one and six for the smaller one. And when we tell you a price, like we give you a price on something, we say it's price $10, you get it for just one half that, or $5. Creamer and sugar, Waverly, no decoration on it, and the price? $5. Next we have a peerless, it's either a violet vase or? A, a big sherbet. And it's we, like to, we like to sell them for violet vases. They bring more money. And it's marked with the diamond nature on the bottom. It's $10. Here we have a chrysolite, 4 o'clock relish, 4 dividers on it. It's $10, no damage. Here's another piece of chrysolite. It's the cigarette footed holder, and it's $10. Have a colonial puff box and cover. Not a sterling top, but it's a plated top. It has a little monogram on it, and it's $5 before the discount. We have a narrow flute shot glass we've got eight of these available and they're 15 dollars each here we have a plain band toothpick or if you're buying that plain band toy set this is actually the spooner for that has an itty bitty nick right there on the bottom of it 10 ducks here's a flat panel 352 toothpick holder it's 25 dollars ground and polished on the bottom here we have a two handle i believe it's a cheese dish and crystal light four dollars we have a doorknob or the handle to the doorknob it's 65 dollars does have a little itty bitty piece right there and it has the cross on the back and it's 65. Ridsley, two handle, jelly dish, $10. Another set, a mayo set in Ridgely. We have the ladle, which is marked with the Heise. The mayonnaise. mayonnaise and the underplate, all three pieces for $35. For all three pieces. Here we have a Waverly footed jelly. Sometimes these are a little tall. This is a little short one, and it's only six dollars. Next is a groove and slash pitcher. Someone has bumped the handle, so it is cracked, but it's only thirty dollars. You can see if you can give them a good picture of that handle, sir. See there, see that funny looking thing through the handle? You see that in there? That's because someone has bumped that at some time and it does fracture. Doesn't matter when it happened, it's cracked. Here we have a one quart cocktail shaker, has a monogram on it. Buy it for the stopper and the strainer. Strainer's got a little chip, it'll still fit in your cocktail shaker. And the price on that is $40. Putney Diamond Point Carafe or water bottle, and it's $135, it's in great condition. Clean on the inside. Here we have, looks like a national soda with tally ho etching. They're $20 a piece. And Sarah's holding up three fingers. We've got three fingers on that. Here's an aqua caliente with tally ho etching on it as well. It's $25 each, and I think we have about 12 available. 
Here we have an old sandwich. Well, I suppose that's a footed tumbler. Eight dollars. How many do we have, Sarah? Three available. Three available. And you can take one, two, or all three. Next, we have a Moon Gleam Wide Flat Panel Creamer and Sugar. And for the set, it is $55. Beautiful color on that. Here we have a Fancy Loop. This is a little syrup or a little molasses. It's got that okay top there on it. Original, and it's $65. I couldn't find any damage on it whatsoever. Here's the Large Horsehead Cigarette bar Box or Cigar Box. Good condition, and it's $65. We have two different lavender jars. We have a small one and we have a big one. The small one's $35, the big one's $45, and they're both perfectly clean on the inside. Next, we have a Lariat three-part relish, or, and it's $15. And it is marked right there in the center. Here we have a little Empress lion head footed. They call this a plate because it's kind of flat. Sarah's going to give you the dimensions on it. 13 inches. 13 inches. Turn it over so we can see one of those lion's heads on it. Oh, there's the feet too. See the lion's head? And then there's his paw for the foot. And you have to really watch those feet. Those feet, what gets damaged on it. One of the few things that Heisey put a lion on. And the price on it is? $250. $250. $125 at the discount. What a bargain. Next, we have a Greek key. That, that's a one pint pitcher. Smallest size they made. Someone has bumped this handle, so it's cracking the handle. Yeah, I'll let you do the next one, Sarah. How much is it? $35. $35. Okay, go ahead. Tell them about the rose footage to that saucer champagne. <laughs> Four available. <laughs> $12 each. $12 each. Then we have the medium flat panel, cream and sure, just like the Moongain pair. Good color on these. They're marked $35 for the pair. Next we have eight Flamingo Yeoman uh, punch cups we have with diamond optic and they're five dollars each you can take one or all eight we don't care here we have two salt shakers the one on the right is narrow flute and it's twenty dollars i've not seen that one before and the one on the left is tudor haven't seen that one before either the tudor one's marked on the inside original tops 20 bucks piece here is a souvenir punch cup it has m-e-m -E -M monogrammed on it and it says 18.98 and it is ten dollars here we have a Continental Punch Cup. How many of these do we have, Sarah? Four. And how many, And they're $4 a piece. Here we have a pair of Ridgely candle holders. And they're $30 for the pair. Hmm, I don't know which one this is, but this is a Hawthorne Tumbler. Looks like it has that real narrow optic to it. Hasn't been repaired on top. Good color, $55. Next we have 10... Colonial plates. And they're about eight and a half inches. And there's 10 of them. You can take one or all 10. We don't care. Four dollars each. Four bucks. Here's a walled off Astoria, number 333 decanter. No stopper, but it is clean on the inside. I'm sure everybody's got a stopper laying around to stick in that. 20 bucks. 20 bucks. Here's a Yeoman Parfait. We have one available and it's $15. And the color on it is absolutely horrible. Okay, we have a two-handled bullion. Bullion, thank you very much on that, Sarah. Had a <laughs> brain fart there. Twenty-five dollars each. How many do we have? Two. Just two available. Plantation blocks. The pair is sixty-five dollars. Good condition. Have to think about this for a second. This one's going to be Pluto. Has a nice little cutting around the base. One available. It's fifteen dollars. Here we have two twist nut cups. We have a flamingo. That's fifteen. And a crystal one that is five dollars. Here's that plain panel recessed footed salt. We get these there once while it's eighteen dollars. These are usually marked. I didn't look at this one, but I'll guarantee it's Heisey. Sahara dolphin footed nut cup, twenty dollars. Two available. Coarse rib mustard jar, Hawthorne stain. Another company bought this off of Heisey. It was crystal when they bought it. They heated it up, sprayed some kind of metal on it, turned it uh, marigold, which looks a lot nicer than Heisey's marigold. It's five bucks. Empress. Cruet. Cruet. Good condition. Stopper's in good condition, clean on the inside. It is a little orange color, not the flamingo. It's $65. It's still flamingo. It's just not that real pretty color. 
Here we have a Victorian Cruet original stopper. It is marked as $30. Clean on the inside. Everything we sell you is going to be clean on the inside. We guarantee that. If it's got a little cloud in it, we're going to put it on the machine and clean it before we ship it to you. Empress Cruet in crystal. It's $40 and it's in good condition. Mm, skirted panel, toy candle holders, $25 for the pair. Are they marked, Sarah? Yes. Both marked. Lariat fan vase, $6. $6. Buy that and use it. Oh, boy. This is a candle holder. Centennial. Oh, okay. Thank you very much. She says it's a centennial candle holder. I don't know if it's centennial or not. Anyway, marked at the top of the handle. Hey, inside that top, is that one, one, one of, that's one of those that's been ground on the inside. We don't know why, but they just ground some of them on the inside. Anyway, hard to find candle holder, $30. We have Flamingo Twist Goblet. It does have a little itty bitty. Point it out to them, Sarah. Right, right there. there. Right there. Itty bitty, it's, but it's there. It's $75. Nice piece. You hardly ever find those. Last piece is a plantation tort plate, about 10 inches across, and it's $15. $15. All right, put our cards out there, Sarah. We're going to put a plug in for the three shows coming up in June. All right, the first one's going to be Fostoria. It's going to be June 9th, 10th, and 11th. Show opens up on Friday, June the 9th. Uh, the card says, I think it's $20 mission, but you can actually get into $10 a mission on that show. Then if you stick around till Sunday, they've got a flea market. Nice show, always full of dealer, nice friendly people, a show you don't want to miss. Here's a note of the show you don't want to miss, especially if you're a Heisey collector. It's a Heisey glass show. It's going to be in the GMP Union Hall there on Hudson Avenue in Newark, Ohio, Friday, June 16th, 1 to 7. Saturday, June 17th, 10 to 2, free admission. If you look right there, Durwood Vogel, he's the son of Clarence Vogel. It came out of the Vogel books. He's going to be at this show. If you bring your Vogel books in, he'll sign them for you. He's one of the last descendants, of uh, last children anyway, of Clarence Vogel, and he'd just love to see everybody. So we we'll hope you can make it at that show. And now we're going to show you the piece we're going to be taking to convention this year, to that show. Here you go, folks. You're right. It's a ball vase, but the ball vase, if you look at the top of it, they never took the top ring off of it, so then they put a fixture on it, and they made a water lamp out of it. And looky there, it's also, it has sea glaze cutting on it. This is kind of a popular cutting. If you wonder what the price is, you're gonna have to come to our show. It'll be there Friday when the show opens. I can't guarantee it'll be there Saturday when the show opens. So that concludes our video for today. We hope to see you in a week from now. It's countdown time. Just a few weeks left before the shows begin. So remember everybody, Come to the shows. We don't want to make any money. We just love to sell Heisey glassware.